So that is Ignis's core! Amazing! It sparkles so magnificently! Here we go again. Again? So then I guess you've already seen my sister in ruin mode. Ruin mode? Rain's an absolute maniac about ruins, ancient civilizations, and stuff like that. I'm not a maniac, I'm a researcher! Huh, yeah, right, right. Anyway, she always gets like this when she sees ruins. Hey, that's just like Emil when he's in his Rabbitosk mode. Wait a minute. I'm not sure those two things have much to do with each other. Marta, I want to see the ritual for hatching a centurion. Perform it! R right! Ignis is now awake. As Ignis's powers return, Emil, as a knight of Ratatosk, you should also awaken to new powers. So, um, now we need to recruit fire elemental monsters. That would gradually bring back Ignis's powers. And I should get stronger too, right? doing all of this in order to save this world. We have to find all of the Centurion's cores so that we can wake up Ratatosk. Please, give us Lumen's core. All right, that's enough. Hand over Ignis's core. Marta, we have to take back Lumen's core by force. Why even try to reason with this murderous man who killed innocent people in Palma Costa in cold blood? Come on, Lloyd. You have to tell them. Tell them that you didn't attack Palma Costa. All of these rumors about you. You didn't do any of that stuff, right? <sighs> Lloyd, please answer me! Yes, Lloyd. Is there something you can't tell us? What is it? Or perhaps the rumors about you are true? I don't have to answer you. Now then, hand over the Centurion's core. If you refuse me, I won't hesitate to take it by force. But Lloyd! Why? This is for those you killed! Die! You still have much to learn. doesn't look good. That monster is blind with rage. Damn it! Here he comes! Oh, violent 
changes your whole personality, on top of giving you new powers. Indeed. I'm sure Emil has his hands full simply controlling the power he receives from Ratatosk, which is why he often can't control his own emotions. Then he's just like Rain when she's in ruin mode, giving in to her desires, unable to control her maniac urges. Ow! That hurts! Just like me. Could that mean he has another self sealed away inside him? If so... What's wrong? It's nothing. No! Such an invaluable cultural treasure. These poor ruins. Here comes ruin mode. Rain truly is a multifaceted individual. Are you really that upset that the ruins are ruined? Whoa, Emil, careful what you- Of course I am! Do you mean to say you're unaware of the cultural, the historic, the scientific value of the Tree at Ruins? <laughs> Listen closely. The Tree at Ruins first came to prominence two regenerations ago, when the spirit Ifrit summoned his Hellfire and- Oh, great. We're in for it now. I guess Emil really has it in for Lloyd, huh? You still believe in him even after you saw how he behaved? Here's what I think. Lloyd wouldn't be doing these things without some reason. I guess. I had a friend I failed to believe in at the final moment, when it mattered most. That's why I've got to find Lloyd and hear what he has to say. I won't give up till I've talked with him. We'll see if my trust in him holds up after that. I'm jealous of you, Genus. Huh? I could never do anything like that. Confronting someone that you know has changed? It's too much for me. 